13 plus inches of run to the arm side. One, two, line, left center. That's in a base hit in Fresno State leads. It'll be cut off in the alley. Now it eludes Stevens and it trickles onto the warning track. And Blanford will turn it second, get all the way to third. Newton scores. Blanford drives in the game's first run. He's only batting 365 over the last 20. He hammers one here, deep right field, way back there. Asby at the warning track, and it is gone. Over the Bud Light sign, and Saldivar touches them all. A one-out solo home run and a 2-0 Fresno State lead. Eighty-two mile an hour breaking ball to ninety-five mile an hour heater in the first. He swings here and hammers one way back to left center. Drops the bat and watches it sail off the facing of the Davalo Center, the Lobo basketball practice facility behind the left center field wall. Pepe with a no doubt blast, his team best ninth big fly and thirty-seventh RBI. Back to back bombs. For Fresno State, that will counts of his night. Pretty efficient so far. Approaching 40 pitches on the evening. The payoff. This is raked down the left field line. That's a fair ball. Extra bases for Kincaid. Dixon will turn it third, get waved home. He'll score easily. Standing up on a ringing double in the left field corner for Connor Kincaid. Two and two now to Holland. Here it comes. Swing and a high fly ball, center field. It's deep. McKernan tracking to the wall. McKernan can't get it. It's off the batter's eye in play for extra bases. Kincaid is scored. As he getting waved around third, he will score. Holland at third base with a wall banging two run triple. And we're tied at three here in the third. Almost three weeks, missed eight games with an oblique. Here's a chopper, left side, off the glove of the shortstop, Newton. Trickles into shallow left. Holland will score, Spenrath into second. It'll be an infield hit all the way. Lobo's prolific double play turners as this one is skied down the right field line toward the corner. Asby won't get it, it's off the track and it'll bounce up and off the top of the wall and out of play for a ground rule double. Tyler Davis drives in Newton, the game is tied. Two-two. Swing and a liner, left field, that's in for a base hit. Blanford scores, Davis into third, he'll be held up. Throw in is cut off, RBI single for McKernan. Fresno State back in front by... Lobos 12th in all of D1 baseball and double play turns. They already turned their 32nd of the year earlier. Here's a hot chopper toward short, there's Dixon. He feeds second for one. The Kincaid relay in time. First and third, one out. 2-1 pitch, grounded up the middle. Diving attempt by Dixon, can't get this one. Into left center for a base hit. Gray turns at third and heads for home. He will score. Throw into third base is late. Five game stretch where he went 0 for 13. Struck out five times. His average dipped all the way from 300 to 226. Here he lines one up the middle. It's right at Stevens. He'll make the grab. Tagging at third is Newton. He will score. In my experience anyway. All the way to second base. Pepe on the E5. Hoppy rakes one into left field, a base hit. It'll be knocked down by Wood on the backhand. That'll score a run, throw into second base is not in time. Hoppy with a single and an error. Swing and a high drive here, deep right center field. Asby turning, Asby watching, and this one is off the track and up and over the wall for a ground. Lobos and Fresno State. 2-2 two -two pitch, breaking ball, chops softly up the middle. The second baseman, Saldivar, can't get it on a dive. Here comes Spenrath around third, he will score. Two out RBI single for Walker in a pinch hit roll. The loss goes to Dane Pengeli. Three plus, eight hit, six earned with a walk and a strikeout for Pengeli. Pengeli's record dips.